when something is removed from society, or, you know, is slowly being removed from society, there will usually be something to fill that void. And the thing to fill that void will often be just as bad as what was there previously. We know the problems with organized religion. The problem is the judgments, the dogma, the ideological thinking, this idea that if you follow a, set, a certain set of rules, um, that makes you a more moral person. And now we have those same problems from something that's not really considered a religion. It's the whole inter intersectionality and social justice advocacy that, 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 that's taken to extremes. There's definitely dogma. There's definitely a lot of judgments. And there are uh, people want to follow these, these sets of rules and say these certain phrases so they can feel better about themselves, so they can feel like a moral person. It's the same thing. Right now, it's the original sin of being born a, a white male. All these complaints can go towards especially cis uh, heterosexual white males. And if people who are cis uh, heterosexual white males try to defend themselves, well, they're evil for defending themselves because, well, when they defend themselves, it's... Uh, it's racist, it's uh, misogynistic, it's, you know, and so on, right? Oh, it's toxic masculinity. So, we're just supposed to take it and do make all these changes to be, to be what you want with no complaints, with no pointing out problems with other demographics. We're just supposed to take it. Not mattering whether or not some of these behaviors that are complained about are far worse in other demographics. I'm sorry, but if you want to go for homophobia and uh, uh, toxic masculinity and misogyny, I'd say the black community has that going on more than, well, then you've got, you've got the uh, Muslim community to some degree too, but... Um, You've got those communities that that are just it's just rampant in in those in in uh, misogyny, homophobia, toxic masculinity, just rampant in those. But you can't complain about it because oh well that would be racist. And intersectionality, no no, you can only complain about the people who have power. That's a crock of shit as far as I'm concerned. Okay, when I when I when I if I see a bunch of a bunch of people. Uh, group together and they're all doing this masculine posturing you know they 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 they're standing with the with they're just with these certain i don't know they're just i i don't even know how to do it exactly um just people grouped together doing massive masculine posturing like i'm some sort of badass right like they're some sort of badass right and i'm not supposed to, i'm supposed to not be scared I'm supposed to not be alarmed. I'm supposed to treat that as if it's just flowers and rainbows. Oh no, those people are great. Regardless of what my personal experience has been. Regardless of what the personal experience of people that I know has been. No, I'm not. We're supposed to throw all of that out because only white guys are bad for that behavior. For even when it's a tenth of that behavior. It's, it's frustrating. And then there's behavior of women that make that, that complement the guys being more, you know, being supposedly misogynistic. There's, there's female behavior, there's women's behavior that make guys act the way they do. 
But that can't be talked about. No, 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 no. Only, only attack those with power. Only those with power. Sorry, no. You know, it... it Flipping the roles of who is bad and who is good, it doesn't help the problem. Okay, we should be able to talk about problems in all demographics. But we can't right now. Universities tell us we can't talk about that. So that's the scary thing, is this this new the new dogmatic judgmental beliefs aren't coming from religious books now. They're coming from universities. How is that supposed to work? How is that supposed to be combated? Well, apparently we're not supposed to. It, we're just supposed to let that become the new religion, that take the place of religion. I guess I shouldn't call the new religion. I'll just say it takes the place of religion, and we're just supposed to put up with it. You know, sometimes we should let a void be a void. But uh, no, no, not, not with the way things are now. And to even mention that it's similar to a religion offends people. Well, that's tough. You're acting like religious people. You're acting like organized religious people. You're just doing it in different areas. It's bullshit.